Mameneja na maafisa wakuu wa kampuni ya umeme nchini KPLC leo walifikishwa mahakamani ambapo walikanusha mashtaka yanayowakabili. Maafisa hao wameshtakiwa kwa madai ya ununuzi wa transformers za viwango duni, ubadhirifu wa fedha na ukiukaji wa sheria katika kutoa zabuni kwa kampuni 525. Haya najiri huku waziri wa Kawi Charles Ketera akitangaza mabadiliko katika usimamizi wa KPLC kwa muda. Aliyekuwa meneja mkurugenzi wa kampuni ya umeme nchini Ben Chumo, mrithi wake Kenta Rus, meneja mshirikishi Peter Mwashigi, katibu wa masuala ya sheria wa kampuni hiyo Beatrice Meso na mameneja wengine tisa walifika katika mahakama ya milimani jijini Nairobi. Washikiwa hao wote walikanusha mashtaka uhalifu wa uchumi na kula njama ya kununua transformer za viwango duni. Vikao mahakamani vilishuhudia majibizano kati ya mawakili wa serikali na mawakili wa washukiwa kuhusiana na swala la washukiwa hao kuachiliwa kwa dhamana. And this is a formal document. That person who is signed and then if, if they do not honor the conditions of that summons or order then the court may issue a warrant of arrest. Mapema la siri ya leo waziri wa Kawi Charles Keter na bodi ya kampuni ya umeme nchini Waliahikishia taifa kuwa operesheni kwenye kampuni hiyo zitaendelea kwa njia shwari licha maafisa wake kutiwa nguvuni. We believe that you have what it takes to drive this company to the next level. And therefore um, uh, we are here in solidarity with you. We want to encourage you to be strong and firm. We also want to encourage our shareholders. KPLC is a listed company. It's not only, I mean, it's not a local company. It's a listed company. Uh, therefore, we want to encourage all the shareholders that the company will come, who is strong enough, will sustain the challenges which are there, and move on. We are, we are not going to look back. Keter, either lizindua kaimu wa meneja wa kampuni hiyo, watakao hudumu hadi kesi wa shukio itakapo kamilika. Nae mbunge wa soi kalip kusitanyi ya michangia sola hilo, huku akimtaka mkurugenzi wa idara ya mashtaka ya Uma Nurdin Haji kuatia nguvuni wote waliohusika na ufisadi kwenye kampuni hiyo lakini wale ambao walishikwa kuna wengine ambao walikuwako katika hayo mashirika ambao bado wako na makazi kubwa katika serikali na bado hawajaitwa kwenda kutoa statement na hawajatiwa baroni if we are to fight corruption we want there should be no sacred cow nikiripotia jamvila mbci Jina langu ni Mangicho Mola